All right, ladies and gentlemen, I am watching Where the Dead Go to Die. I know very little about this movie. All I know is that TikTok has recommended it to me, saying that this is disturbing, that it will mess you up. Am I watching a bad version of the movie? Is that why there's this crunching gargly sound or is that part of the movie? Okay, we have chapters. Tainted milk. The screenshots I saw did not look flattering, but okay, no, actually this looks kind of on board. Where did babies come from? So this is just a shit post. This is just a shit post. Why are we why are we doing this? TikTok. You want to know about babies, do you? Old pleasure Do you know back in old YouTube where someone would play an episode of Tom and Jerry or like Dragon Ball Z and there's just a guy with a webcam mic just saying the most childish shit over the entire cartoon so it's funny? Oh, so you're really gonna suck my dick, Goku? I'm gonna do it right now! Even what I just did is funnier than I'm sure whatever I'm gonna see right now. I'm a little upset. I knew it was gonna look bad. I just didn't know. I guess the voice acting shouldn't surprise me? We must kill. Huh? I don't know, Labby. Remember that time? <laughs> His name's Labby? Is it because he's a lab? Actually, he doesn't look like a lab. Maybe Rottweiler? Maybe a mix. Yeah, yes, yes, Tommy. Tainted. Yes, yeah. I think the audience understands you're a dog. You don't need to keep panting throughout your lines. I, I don't even know if there's a point in arguing with anything in this film. Parents, but they wouldn't- I try to ask my parents, but- I'm just wearing a baseball cap and I'm a seven-year-old. What do I know? How did this movie get any traction at all? Is it because someone, one random dude shared a clip of it and they were like, what the fuck is this? And they were like, oh, you were curious. The lady in the well. The lady in the well. Okay, I have to pause this. Jesus. I, hold on. Maybe, maybe I was looking at someone who was being, what's the word, facetious in the recommendation here. Where was the guy that recommended it to me? Who was it? Was it this guy? Who would have thought this video sponsored by Raid? Give me time to explain. RPG is free to play. Yeah, don't be afraid. A boss is causing you pain. Damn, your champion is main. But the throne will be reclaimed. Now, nothing stays the same. You gotta climb the dome tower. That's the end game. You need champions on champions. A good thing there's a bunch. You need specialists in strategy. The boss is really tough with the buffs. Raid Call of the Arbiter Episode 1 is out now, so Raid's adding some of the new characters you'll see in this limited series. One of them being the bad boy orc Artak, and you can get him by just logging into Raid for 7 days between now and the 24th. Who would have thought this video sponsored by Raid? Scan the QR code or use my link below to get insane bonuses. And the bonuses have big champion Knight Aaron and none of the useful things with the right merit. Click the link below, scan the QR code. And thank you, Raid Shadow Legends, for sponsoring this video. Who told me so I can be upset with them? It wasn't this person. <laughs> it also wasn't the guy whose entire channel is just saying fake, scary, slash disturbing movies and making up some statistic being like 95% of viewers couldn't finish this. That guy's actually hilarious. There is a new horror movie on Netflix that some people are saying is the scariest movie ever made. It's called Untold and according to this Netflix algorithm report, Okay, so I don't want him to spoil it for me, but <laughs> even though, like, I shouldn't care that much, but I'm gonna finish the movie. Okay, I just wanted to make sure that I did not, uh, very much like this movie, hallucinate that. Ooh. We have up the budget. Ah! God. Okay, so both of his parents are sleeping naked in the room right now, and- Oh! Okay, so n none of this can be shown, even though it uh, doesn't look like much of anything, right? Okay, so devil demon dog named Labby told- What's his name? Peter? Jimmy? What the fuck? You fucking dog! What the fuck? What are you- Stupid dog! Oh, you're eating my dick! There's too much happening. My, my brain is being overstimulated to hell and back right now. The dog said, do it, Jimmy, whatever his name is. Um, I'm not even gonna call Jimmy a pussy on this one. 
the dog, because that's what the guy was starting to say in the review, right? He started to say, oh, but when he refuses to do so, the dog gave him a total of two and a half seconds to kill his mother. And I feel like he maybe thought about it, but at that point, the dog jumped up and then dove into pregnant Punani and played fetch. Then there was a zoom in on the baby <laughs> falling back. It would have been funny if he like put out his hand or something, but he just kind of fell back just like stiff and he was like, no, <laughs> I don't think he made a noise, but I, but you're hearing all these voices. And at this point, I don't know who to attribute what voice to, but there was panic in the air and I saw a baby fly back. Now he also bit the dad's wiener and, and, and elongated it in the process. And now he's biting his neck. Uh, we're not even eight minutes into the movie. Why did you do that? And Jimmy's just sat here. We, we had to cut it off at the source. That's a good point. Oh, the dog was a figment of his imagination. He's actually the... Okay, never mind. The child is now falling into a pit of bald men. Okay, so this is the whole fever dream aspect everybody was uh, discussing. Oh, what? High frame rate. Get that out of here. <laughs> is this just gonna hallucinate for the rest of the- Oh, that's a nice photo, you guys. Dear, the cookies are ready. Oh, no. Mom's a furry! There's no way in hell there's another hour and 25 minutes of this, right? My eyes! Chapter 2. <laughs> I, it's funny, they've said his name so many times now, and I still don't know. Is it Johnny or Jimmy? They say dogs are supposed to be man's best friend. They say dogs are supposed to be man's best friend. Now I'm on it, sir. Let me show you something. We have found our end. Okay, Jesus. Oh, so I, that was... I didn't mean, like, he's... That was my reaction. That was a reactionary word. Best solution has been to keep- Does he have like a, a three second echo delay on his lines? Hey, it's the dog again. I am the ultimate sacrifice My what? So you didn't- This is just a recap here. Uh, the boy had to had to give up his virginity in order for Demon Dog to uh, work through through God because they negotiate apparently uh, to bring back his parents. The boy then proceeded to doggy style, and now he's just kind of gone. Unrelated question. Assuming this is just a massive shit post and someone just trying to just be as edgy as possible, right? Would it have killed you to maybe not have such a goofy main character voice? I know no one should give a damn, but I feel like the opportunity was there to maybe not have it be like, oh, well, boy, where's like so, like, hey, Scoob, like, but it's just kind of irritating. Like, you put all this work into the movie already, and with all the work you put into the movie already, I mean, you might as well fucking get like, it doesn't even have to be good voice acting, just not this. Oh, the baby's still on the floor, look at that. So the demon dog duped him, <laughs> is essentially what happened. He was waiting for the transaction to go through, it did not, and now we are looking at um, some really nice uh, transition titles. He'll, uh, he, sorry, my brain's trying to read this and it was not working. Let's say chapter 11. It's a shadow man, don't trust him, Tommy. His name's Tommy, that's what it is, not Jimmy, you dumbass. It looks like the Dumb and Dumber guy. All right. Not Dumb and Dumber guy, uh, Home Alone. Almost impossible. Yeah, that was like 100% base on the Home Alone guy. As we grow older, we start having negative encounters with death. Like, this guy was kind of trying on his lines. Why didn't the boy get the same respect, especially when he's the main character? I feel like I'm not going to be able to actually to show any of this movie. There's something dead in the majority of scenes. When they come through. The distortion between our worlds causes a glitch. We want more babies falling in slow motion. This is boring. Get down on your knees. What is she doing? Faster. In the bushes. Okay. Now there's a general. 
Oh, he's a guy with PTSD who's also an amputee who also likes a woman rubbing WD-40 on his metal leg. Yeah, this guy definitely had the right idea putting the dog portion first because if these were in a different order, nobody would have watched this shit. Oh, it was her! She's the one who took your legs! <laughs> I, I genuinely don't even know what to do while watching this movie. Do I try and just draw random comedy from it? Do I try and describe it to you guys? Because I'm sure you're not able to see what's on screen right now. Like the prostitute just stabbed him with the opposite side of a bottle and he tried to gouge her eye. So now she's crawling towards a church, I think, where the Home Alone guy is. And he's surrounded by demons after talking, having his little monologue about collecting the juice from the back of a brain. Like, you see what I mean? Like, why, why would I do that to you guys? I might have to like, might have to like 1.5 this one, guys. Like even, even this lady's kind of trying on her lines. I don't understand why the, the other guy, the kid didn't get that same luxury. That's what's bothering me out of this movie. Even look at me. I thought she died. She collapsed on the floor. What? She's just being so, so articulate disgusting. in her last moments. Uh, why is that guy walking like that? Thoughts? I will watch this to the 30 minute mark and then I am speeding up the playback rate because this sucks. Okay, so uh, the Max Payne Home Alone guy plugged in some of the blue juice that he's been talking about, and now he's having his own hallucination. My dog's name was Scruffles. Oh no, Scruffles! He's the demon dog! What did you do to him? It caused him to break out into hives. Oh. The hives. Gotcha. Right. Okay. Men with big eyes that look like that one SpongeBob episode. Oh no, he's got a dead rabbit. Why does this feel like the normal speed? I'm just trying to save it. Okay, guys, I thought I was gonna last a little longer on that. We're going a two times speed. Okay, so this man seems to be reminiscing of his uh, childhood trauma, which has to do with like incest and stuff like that. The huge. How is this still moving slowly? I don't understand. There's so much shit happening on screen. I'm seeing so many different things. I'm it's it's all hallucinations and it's still dragging at two times speed. We have graduated at three times speed, ladies and gentlemen. The last uh, like five minutes, I'm not able to show you any of it on YouTube. Definitely not what I'm looking at now. Okay, so he created Scruffles. He left his dog out in the rain. His, his dog got hives. He didn't know about his allergies. Then his dog got hives slash possessed. Why does he love me enough to come and get me? Why did he abandon me? <laughs> this guy's voice acting is actually very funny sped up. Uh, just in case you're curious about anything I'm viewing right now, it has just been a lot of sex. What did this have to do with the uh, amputee who served in the war? Or I guess even Tommy. This just, oh wait, okay, no, now we're back to Tommy. Just kidding, I just saw Tommy as soon as I brought him up. <laughs> you don't wanna know what I just saw? <laughs> Monsters, where? Is this even a video, guys? I, I would love nothing more than to do anything else right now. I'm like diving into a picket fence. Yeah, I'm, I'm sure there's a story here that's kind of connected vaguely. But at this point, it's just the most ridiculous shit you can think of. And I know that's unfair to say because when I was told that it's super fucking ridiculous, I couldn't even have pictured half of this shit. But that's because it's just... It's like mad-libbing, disturbing things. And just being like, can I animate that? I can? Okay. I'm gonna put it in the movie. I guess there's another character we're bringing into this, unless this is one of the other characters, just as a child. He's a kid who always wears a ski mask. He really likes this girl whose dad is a hillbilly, and he's giving him this VHS tape saying, yo, check this shit out. I'm sorry guys, I just can't even justifiably give this movie the time of day to make fun of it. Not only that, it's boring as shit. It's trying so hard to do the thing that I can't even describe it to you. I damn sure can't show it. I'm gonna do me and my editor a favor here and just start skimming. I made it to the hour mark straight, even though it was sped up. 
This dog seems to be talking about the other timelines. I still don't know who this child with the ski mask is. We seem to be zooming in on chapped lips. The ski mask child is being strangled. Uh, his mom smokes cigarettes. She should quit. Now he's been tossed into a nursery room by his dad who's naked. He keeps going back to the hillbilly man like, a, like he's a GTA guy giving out missions. Oh, he's having him take the mask off. Wait, this part matters a lot because I need to know who that man child is. Oh, he's a disfigured boy with a another baby face. You know, it's funny. At first, I was wondering, why isn't this movie on any streaming sites? I'm just trying to watch it. Asked and answered. Okay, wait, hold on. There looks like there's some morality in this movie. The child with the mask is now apologizing to the girl that he did the thing with. Is her voice AI? I'm tired of making people bleed. Okay, I'm going back to three times. Hey, look, it's Demon Dog again. Okay, so this is just the same scenario from the first chapter where the Demon Dog is telling the kid to kill his parents. And now he's killing everybody that deceived the girl he liked. Also, the general's there? When did he get there? Okay, I think I should be at the end of the movie now. There's like five minutes left. Oh, he had a baby face the whole time. Oh, that was actually the end. That was where the dead go to die. Don't watch it. It was very boring. I don't even think this video might... Uh, is this video even live right now? Are you watching this right now? I feel like it won't be. I'm uh, more tired than I was when I started this video. That was just... That was just... That was just drivel. That was nothing. That was... I've never seen a movie that was more absolutely nothing in my life. It was... Um... Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> that sucked. I've missed the GG. Bye. Oh.